what's going on guys today I'm gonna show you how to tumble buff and a tumble buff is basically buffing an unbuffable weapon so it's pretty insane so just all you need is an unbuffable weapon I'm gonna show you this is unbuffable right now see take this talisman I have enough magic and stuff can't buff it and it doesn't matter if I can't use lightning blade because it will still let you. I'll show you this is a buffable weapon. Can't buff it. Tune spell. You don't have to be able to use this buff, so you can go to plus weapon or weapon you can use. See? this weapon right here I try to buff this can't buff it even when I can use the spell so now I'm gonna switch back to lightning blade because it's gonna do more damage perfect so <coughs> now all you're gonna need is any type of heal like a med heal or anything med heal and a weapon buff and then next thing you're gonna need is sunlight talisman or any talisman that casts miracles and the white birch bow or any type of bow except for great bows and crossbows because those do not work so now what you're going to want to do is cast the spell and right after that just back step so basically r1 and then circle so you see now the game thinks we're doing a med heal now you, if if you didn't hear the spell cast. Now, I game thinks we're gonna do a heal, but we're not gonna do a heal, we're just gonna do a heal animation. Switch to your unbuffable weapon. Switch to your lightning blade, not the med heal. Because if you stay at med heal, you're just gonna do what the game thinks you're gonna do. The game thinks you're gonna do a med heal, which is pointless to do this. So switch to your weapon buff. You don't even have to be able to use your weapon buff, but you have to be able to use the med heal. Okay, so now this is the tricky part. You have to back step and press L2 while walking forward. So, right there. See, sometimes it does that weird bow thing. Just restart the whole process. Pull out your talisman. Go to med heal. Swap it out. Hear the animation noise, switch to an unbuffable weapon, do the thing I told you. A lot of times it does that, just don't mind it. No worries, because it's pretty easy once you get the hang of it. Unbuffable weapon, switch to lightning blade, back step. There you go. See, the game, the game says, the game thinks I'm doing a med heal. So it put me in the med heal animation. But instead, I was switched to lightning blade. So I did lightning blade instead of the heal. So if I two hand this, 700 damage. That is just insane. So if I switch this out, two hand it normally, 600 damage. 597 to be exact. But, I can understand why this weapon cannot be buffed, because it does 600 damage without being buffed, which is already pretty insane. So, yeah, this weapon cannot be buffed, and when, it, when I did the buff glitch, it did 700 damage, and normally two-handing it does 600. So that's like a 100 damage bonus, plus 100 damage bonus. That's for Lightning Blade, though, and it depends on your build. But, yeah, you can do it with any buff, as long as it's a weapon buff. So you can do it with infused weapons, you can do it with unbuffable weapons. Can't do it with shields, can't do it with bows, can't do it with flames, pyromancers, any of that. Can't do it with big shields, can't do it with great bows, can't do it with armor, because that's just weird if you do it with armor. Can't do it with anything else, but... So have fun.
killing some people in PvP if you can pull it off in time. Uh, you can buff before a boss fight, which is pretty nice. If you're stuck on a boss right now, if you have this weapon, plus five, you can do an extra 100 damage with this buff glitch. So just have the requirements I told you, and yeah, you guys can just do a ton of damage, I guess. So have fun doing that, dude. Goodbye, everybody. Hope you enjoyed.